the Hilton Head Life. Daniela Swickerow and Rick Hollyfield are here with me. You're both here today. We are, we are. back. It's been a minute since you guys have been together, so <laughs> welcome back. Now. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, right? <laughs> oh, gosh. So what's on everybody's mind right now, of course, is that it's heritage time. Right. And so it's a very exciting time on the island. But what does that mean? You guys are in the luxury market. What does that mean for you? What does it mean for people looking in golf communities? What does it mean for people coming down here and realizing the golf communities that are here? Right. Tell us a little bit about that. Well, focusing, I think, large scale first, and that is where, where are those communities? What are those communities? What do they offer, right? Mm -hmm. So primarily, and you know where Beaufort Lake Hilton and Life Left and all that. Right. So in this case, though, when it comes specifically to golf, there is golf north of the broad, but primarily, if you are a golf-centric buyer, you will be south of the broad. Absolutely. You will be Bluffton or Hilton Head yep. specifically, or Hague Point in the terms of Defusky. Yep. Um, but yeah, do you want to talk a little bit about just what those communities are and um, what, what, what do we have, right? Yeah. yeah the Heritage does an amazing job of putting our island on the world stage every single year. Absolutely. Thanks mm -hmm. to Arnold Palmer, we have an airport, or at least his influence, we have an airport. And uh, people know Hilton Island as a golf place, and now the low country has kind of enveloped that that uh, connotation. Yeah. So we do have great golf. We have private golf, which is a, what a lot of people have an interest in. So we have great private golf communities on, on Hilton Head. We have, of course, Long Cove and Wexford, two yeah. great private courses, private clubs. Um, and those are beautiful. They offer kind of the island lifestyle. But because the island is small, our golf had to grow. And it had to grow out into Bluffton. Mm -hmm. So we have great communities out there, starting with Moss Creek, of course, and then right. we have Berkeley Hall, Belfair, Colleton River, we have Hampton Hall, and we have others like Oldfield, which is uh, just a uniquely different neighborhood. But as Daniela said, south of the Broad is where we really have private golf. Absolutely, absolutely. Right. Do you guys play golf? I'm working on it. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I am extremely competitive. So for me, the answer eventually, ideally, will be yes. She's doing great. Thank you. I, um, I didn't grow up around golf. So I, you know, I knew a couple of friends that played. They played either for the school or, or you know, whatever it was, but I really didn't grow up around it. And so when I moved here, um, that really offered me something that I, really, I wasn't really anticipating or expecting, which was an appreciation for the sport. Mm -hmm. um, I, didn't, I didn't go looking for it. I didn't move here thinking, oh, you know, I'll probably pick up golf. I never would have thought that. But the more I watch it, the more I see it, and the more I realize how beautiful a game it is, and I think ultimately, at least for me, if you're good, it can be relaxing. <laughs> if you're not, it <laughs> can be not, another can story be not completely. Relaxing yes. At all. Yeah. 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 The clubs are clubs are not supposed to be disposable. I learned that. Yes. Yeah. That's true. So, <laughs> but you play. I do. Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah. Clubs aren't disposable. Right. Uh, I'm still missing a six iron out of my bag for the disposable reason, but uh -huh. but I do play, and we've both been members of College and River. We're members right. of Belfair, right. uh, so we know the communities very well, and. Yeah, I think a lot of people ask the question, do you have to be good at golf to live in these neighborhoods? Right. And um, we can attest to very clearly, the answer is no. Right. No, Emphatically you don't. not. Yes. In fact, you don't even Emphatically have to play not. golf to live in these neighborhoods. Yeah. 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 Well, so speaking to that, staying mm -hmm. on the subject mm -hmm. of golf, but speaking to those people that are non-golfers, yeah. what do the communities offer for them? The thing like is if you we, have one half. You know? Sure. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, so sure. we call these golf communities because, first of all, golf is such a visible sport, right? It's If it's there, you can see it. It's yes. a, it takes up geographically a massive, massive spot. Mm -hmm. So we think of golf communities as golf communities, but they're really amenities-rich communities, and they have golf, right? Right. So if they have great golf, that becomes part of it. But there are you know, leisure trails and, and you know, fishing opportunities and biking opportunities and tennis. I mean, typically where there's golf, there's tennis, right? Because oftentimes, this isn't always the case, but oftentimes when you have, um, let's just say standardly, you have the husband golfing, right? Mm -hmm. And the wife, a lot of times if she doesn't golf, she plays tennis. Right. And so that's just a very natural thing that we see. And so there are a lot of other things, you know, great dining, parties and events and social clubs and I mean, gosh, all kinds of things. Golf is just one of the offerings in any of these neighborhoods. Absolutely. Actually, in all the neighborhoods, there are clubs within the club. Exactly. Yeah. And so that can go from cards to art to photography to bird watching in Carlton River, which is actually kind of the origin of Carlton River. Mm -hmm. 
uh, just so many other things. And what we would also say is if they don't have what you want to do, just raise your hand and they'll kind of create they'll whatever that is or around Or let you make it, yeah. 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 Thank you guys for being with us. Thank you're you. Obviously, you're going to come back and we'll learn more about sure. this. Let's do it. So make sure you call the Hilton Life if you want to get into one of those golf communities. Thanks very much.